Hello and welcome to Connecticut Backcountry. I'm Gary and I'm going to show you how I make a Reflectix freezer bag koozie. This is the Reflectix duct tape. This is Gorilla Permanent Tape. This is some Dyneema string. It's a big old monster roll of Reflectix. So a Reflectix pot koozie is just for warming up your meals so you don't use as much gas. For real, that is the whole purpose between doing it in the freezer bag or doing it around your pot. So let's get started. Start laying out our bag. I'm going to start with the bag towards the end of the, with the closure past the end of the Reflectix. I'm going to flip it over. It gives me two lengths and then I'm going to go approximately a third of the bag past and that'll give me my closure for the bag itself and I'm just going to mark that with a marker. Now if you're not familiar with Reflectix, it is in essence two layers of bubble wrap facing each other with a reflective outside and used specifically for insulation. All right, so we're going to cut that line. And it's actually very fine for it to be the width of the bag or approximately thereabouts because we're going to be using the full width of the, the uh, Reflectix. So we can lay the bag out and then we can just cut down that line. Again, doesn't need to really be super exact. So we have our dimensions. We just need to get the folds right. This just needs to be the length of our inside flap. And so we need two pieces. that are about the same length. And this is going to get stuck inside, folded in half, and stuck inside here. So I'm going to take this, fold it in half, pull the paper backing off, and put it like that inside where the, the outside corner is on the outside of the bag. I'm going to cut a small piece of this Dyneema cord and this is this cordage is complete overkill you do not need Dyneema cord to do this stuff's a little forgiving so don't worry if you don't get it right in the right place the first time Not exactly at the top of that. So, lay it over a little bit like that. closure and we have a bag that will hold the freezer bag. And so for this you really just want it down 
like the side approximately stay away from the bottom a little bit and mark where the rope's going to be cut a notch Same thing for the other side. But that's it. That's making a koozie. If you like this video, like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification button because I will have more, more meals coming up that you can make inside this Reflect Exclusive. Not to mention hiking videos, background, backpacking videos, and bushcrafty type stuff. All right, have a good week. We're going to make a reflect. We're <laughs>